Hey y'all, what the hell is tea? This is your boy 50 Shades of Feel coming back to you guys with another TikTok vlog slash YouTube review. Yes, it's going to be on TikTok and YouTube. And what other better way to talk about it than to talk about my girl Beyonce and her Renaissance World Tour in Chicago? Bitch, 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 bitch. Let me get into this Renaissance World Tour. Oh my God, Beyonce, Giselle knows Carter did the damn thing. I should have been gave this review in July, but in July it was kind of a shaky month. Um, there was a recent passing in the family, and yes, that was one of the reasons why I kind of did not talk about the Beyonce concert. I kind of didn't post as much on YouTube, or I kind of didn't post on Instagram or TikTok about the concert because there was a death in the family. Long story short, um, my birthday came up. It is August of, this is what the... This is August 21st. Yes, this is August 21st. And I just still want to talk about this concert because Beyonce is tearing it up in every damn city. Baby, we got to talk about my outfit. First and foremost, this shirt that I'm wearing, I had it made because I was a little afraid about my shirt that I ordered coming in the mail. But it finally came in the mail. And yes, y'all get into it. My outfit, I had a metallic slash cowboy slash cowgirl feel, and I had on a hat with crystals. And uh, it was really, really cute. I had on a glimmery shawl, and it was just amazing, y'all. My outfit was everything for this concert. But yes, she performed July 22nd in Chicago at Soldier Field. And yes, we're just to dive right into this concert. Baby, she did all of my favorite cuts, except... Now hold on Beyonce, I got a bone to pick with you. Cause why the hell wasn't thick? And why the hell wasn't all up in your mind? And why the hell wasn't drunk in love on the set list from the get go? Bitch, Beyonce performed mostly all of the song, but she didn't perform every single song on the Renaissance album. Bitch, I'm, I, I'm gonna just tell you, I'm a little blue about that. Because she finally decided to put thick and she finally decided to put all up in your mind on the set list. Why she removed them songs in the beginning, I will never know and I will never understand it. But yes, she finally did it in Atlanta, Georgia, which is actually where I did my birthday trip this year. I went to Atlanta. Long story short, baby, this concert was amazing in Chicago. I'm telling you, everybody looked amazing. That's first and foremost. She actually said that Chicago was the best dress because we actually looked the part. We all had that metallic cowboy feel, cowgirl feel. Um, it was giving Met Gala uh, in Chicago, and I live for it. But yes, I really, really love everybody outfits. But oh my God, stage presence. Oh my God, 10 out of 10. Beyonce tore my head off just like I knew she was going to do it, baby. Them visuals. Like, 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 bitch, we gotta talk about these visuals. Oh my God. Them visuals were everything. It was so unexpected. Baby, when I tell you, the visuals, it's the visuals for me that made this concert an amazing show. And generally, uh, Beyonce always gives her hundred percent. She gives you your. She she she's gonna give you a show, baby. But baby, them visuals take the cake. I'm telling you. Uh, I I don't even know where to begin. I I don't want to fully say everything about it because I don't want to spoil it for people who didn't see the show. But oh my God, it was colorful, inspirational. She put a hint of her self-titled album in the visuals. Uh, oh my gosh, she just put her all into this show and um, she really did the damn thing. Y'all, I am really, really, really blown away still by this concert. It will never be forgotten, I'm telling you. This was one of her best, best, best damn shows ever. You thought Homecoming was good? <laughs> you thought the Formation World Tour was good? You thought the Miss Carter World Tour was good? Baby, you ain't seen shit until you seen the Renaissance World Tour. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. Baby, the Renaissance World Tour is one of her best shows ever. I'm telling you, 
this is this was a brilliant tremendous this is beyond words that anybody can describe just 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 visuals in between the songs coming in um uh, oh my god uh man she gave you everything that you needed she gave me vogue like i wanted bitch let me talk about my favorite performances hold on y'all know what i'm getting ready to say pure honey bitch hold on we gotta talk about pure honey first that is my favorite song on the Renaissance album, but bitch, that was my favorite performance of that night. Even though I love every single song. Oh, also, Alien Superstar was about, but baby, pure honey. I just knew Beyonce was going to understand the assignment of that song. She gave me ballroom, honey. She gave me Vogue, honey. She gave me everything I wanted and needed for pure honey. Alien Superstar was alienated. I lived for it. It was the green effect. I loved it. She had the best outfit for it. She had the best. I mean, she did this little remix thing in between it and killed it. Oh, my God. My God. What else? What else? When she did Move. Oh, my God. Cuff it. Y'all, I could go on and on and on and on and on about this concert. But, yes, y'all. My favorite performances. Oh, my God. I love when she did Plastic Off the Sofa. I love when she did Church Girl. Killed it, baby. When she did formation, you know she always got to do the cuts. She did formation. She did partition. She did. You know what I love most about this tour, though, is that she kind of eased the concert in. She started off with Dangerously in Love. Oh, my God. Started off with Dangerously She did I Care. She did all of her older songs first and then moved into the Renaissance part. She did all of her classics at the beginning and then moved on to the hype songs, of the songs from the Renaissance. Then she had this kick-ass intro for the Renaissance part of the album, which I live for. She had her face showing. She was looking golden. She was doing this little thing with her head and was talking. Y'all, I just, the visuals is what I live for. She had stuff about rebirth. She had stuff about like this robotic um type of thing going on. Like this woman is from another damn planet. Whatever planet Beyonce is on, I wanna, I, 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 I wanna be there. I want to be there. I'm telling you, baby, this is a show to remember. You will not be disappointed. I'm just telling you, y'all. You have to go see this show. Uh, uh, this is a must-see because we don't know when this girl, this alien, or whatever you want to call her, is going to do another tour or have another album coming out. So you have to go see her. If you don't, you're going to regret it. I'm just going to tell you that. I love mostly just in general the the, the choreography, the flow of the show is what caught my attention. When I tell you, baby, my mouth was dropped. Like, literally dropped. Uh, 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 just in between this show, y'all. I, it just, I just don't have the damn words to fully describe this damn tour. And I was in the perfect spot. Mind you, I was at the top. And I'm telling you, this is my honest opinion. Yes, I wanted to be in the front. But, of course, a bitch didn't have all that money to be at the front like I wanted to. However, I was not disappointed being at the top. If you really want my honest opinion about this tour, it's better at the top. And this is just my point of view because I got to see every single thing. The whole entire setup of the stage, the lights, just everything. Her coming down, the horse at the end of it, uh... Just everything. I just got a chance to see every single thing. Clear as day at, 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 at this tour. And it's a good thing I wear glasses. Because baby, if I didn't have them on, I wouldn't be able to see a damn thing. But yes, I just... The top of the, the the top is what is what did it for me. I loved it. I was not disappointed. And because this is a stadium tour, this is just seeing it at the top. I think it's better than seeing it at the front. Uh, I am happy for the pure honey section slash beehive section. I'm proud of them bitches. But at the same time, seeing it at the top, you gonna get your life just as well. Cause bitch, I know I did. I'm telling you, I can't go on and on about this tour. Uh, it, it's just it's just amazing, y'all. You guys have to go see this tour. You are not going to be disappointed. I'm telling you, get them tickets. Even if you got to pay $100 to see her last minute, get these damn tickets and go see Beyonce. I'm telling you, you will not be disappointed. Uh, 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 yes, y'all, I enjoyed this concert. Please go see her everywhere. Everywhere.